Hi guys, Peace Pinch here and welcome down to Adair Manor, which is something I've not said before and I am so excited to be saying it now. We're going to play the full 18 holes and I'm going to split this into three parts. This place just looks absolutely stunning and I will be explaining as I go just what potentially makes this place so special and it is a pretty open secret that this place is going for the Ryder Cup as well. So stunning venue, stunning opportunity to get out here and play and I cannot wait. It's going to be me and one of the pros here, Fraser. We're going to have a little bit of a match and it's just hopefully going to be one of the best golfing experiences that I've had. We've also got Carly on the camera as well. She'll be filming everything as we go. So make sure you give the video a nice thumbs up for all the hard work that Carly's put it in. <laughs> Show us your thumb, Carly. She's also injured herself today. And she refuses to go to hospital. She's a trooper. <laughs> I am joined by Fraser. How are we doing, man? You good? Good, thank you. Good and I've, you. I have heard crazy good things about this man's game, by the way. I have been told <laughs> that he is the Tiger Woods of a dare manor. <laughs> We're both not warmed up. I've had, a, I've had a massage this morning, and honestly, my body feels like it is made of actual jelly. In fact, it's melted jelly. It doesn't have had the rigidity of jelly. It is just completely gone. So this first hole could be fun. from across the fairway here, right hand side. The approach into this green, by the way, is uh, dramatic to say the least. Swing around and get this land if you can. One, seven, six. Oh, gonna cut a five iron. Water all in front. Travel. Oh. And that is why I hit five iron, because it was a perfect club, just a fat, that little bit. One hundred and thirty four left in. Fraser has once again absolutely smashed it past me. He's a muscle man. Uh, there's a huge dip on the right hand side of the screen. The pin is tight left though. So got a nine iron. I'm just gonna try and keep it down because it's on a bit of an upslope here as well and it's gonna get up into the clouds. That'd be good. Oh ho ho, hello. Rory likes this hole, I like this hole. It's probably the best hole on the course, I think, so far. Yes, yeah. Break in. Tell you what, on these greens, if you do give them just a little bit, they are racy. 
It's got a massive sub air system here to suck all the moisture out if if they want to. Because what's the fast? 12, 13, you get them to if you really want? Yeah, yeah. Um, usually about 11.5 or 11.5. So this is slightly uphill, but it is downwind. So even this one isn't one I'm going to get too excited with. But birdie chance. Come on, Rory's favourite hole. Is it your favourite hole? Of course it's, of course it's your favourite hole. I mean, I mean, basically, me and Rory were like, like that. Yeah, just left, not too bad. But it's like it amazing, you know. I don't think I don't think you need to go hard at that. Yeah, I, I think nine's the club. That's the one. I'm going big good. Holding one. Oh no! I told you it was an eight. <laughs> You can have that one. Do not get aggressive. Oh, you. I, I don't know what I don't know what he was worried about. I was so far over the water. Oh, phrase. Oh, stop it. Here we go. Here's your chance. All time up and down here. I'll come back down the other side. Yeah, yeah. I should have gone up there. <laughs> Going all time up and down. No, Fraser, no. Sixth hole here, 210 yards. And wow. Can't go left, can't go long, can't go right. You can only miss it short. Water everywhere teeing off a bent grass tee is basically a putting green. I have played on greens, which clubs would call this a good green. So I've teed the ball up high. I'm going to clip it off the top. <laughs> I'm not going to be taking this. I've got a seven iron. Uh, straight down draft. Come on. Now, this will be a hole in one hole. Crikey. All right, dead aim. That looks unbelievable. Never played off a tee this tight. Wow. Oh, it's just going. Land soft. Stay. It's just missed the green left. It's just clung onto the bank. Wow. Wow. I didn't damage the tee, though. I didn't damage the tee. So, oh, look at that. Look at that kicking in. Someone's played here before. So this is one of the features here. I mean, massive slope here. I've to, that's a pretty big pitch mark there. Um, and it's one of those things where if it's just short, it's gonna roll all the way off. Pin's relatively tight. Definitely should have hit it where you hit it. Off to the right-hand side. I got a hole in one excitement there. So I'm gonna have to get it up and stopping quick. It is into a bit of wind though. Yeah, not too bad, not too bad. So one up at the moment. Fraser's got this to go back to all square. And I kind of fancy him for this. He's got that look in his eye. 
devilishly fast down that slope though, Fraser, I have to say, it's scary. Go on, go on, go on. Yes. Right. That was nice. I'm very mate, that is one hell of a hole to get a birdie on. That was awesome. Right guys, that is the end of part one. The match is currently all square after that amazing birdie on that hole. That was an absolutely cracking birdie. And we are gonna be going straight on to the seventh hole, so make sure you stay tuned for that. Adair Manor, thank you so, so much for having us down. It's been a fantastic day so far. Windy, tough, and testing. Brace, thanks so much for ever coming around for us as well and actually showing us the ropes. Make sure you subscribe to the channel, go follow Fraser on all his social and follow Adair Manor as well. And we'll see you back here in just a moment.